Hi my love, Sheree my lady girl from Runaway where we have culture, conversation, and community. And in today's video, I'm coming to you all with a review, not a review girl, we ain't reviewing yet, a reaction video to um, the trailer to Krishan and um, Blueface's new show, Rock Lips Blue, Blue in Love, Rock Your Bells, I don't know, whatever, whatever the name of the show, this is season two. Now if y'all followed the first time I reviewed the show, I said I wasn't going to be doing it anymore because it was just so dark, it was so ugly. I think we're going to have a better more substance in this show now because Krishan is obviously pregnant and is not allowed to be intoxicated in the way that she was on the first season hopefully and less embarrassing so yes I'm going to be doing that before I get into it though make sure you like and subscribe because if you like and subscribe it helps me on my YouTube journey and it also helps you girl because we keep so cute over here <laughs> like that's it the end make sure you follow me on Instagram too um I might get posted back on Instagram. I need to really kind of figure out what it is I'm going to be giving for the next couple of months of the year. But if you're new here, I do these type of reviews. When I talk about Krishan and Blueface, I somehow or another tap into Iyanla, okay? I tap into Iyanla Van Zandt, and I'm trying to like look at it from a different perspective because so many people look up to these kids <clears throat> and there's so much to unpack. So before I get all into it, before I get all crazy, let's just watch it. Let's just see what it's given. And after we watch it, we'll discuss it. Are you here to do paternity testing? Uh, okay. All right, let's go back. We can all agree that a first child for a woman is detrimental to their life. And I don't want to sign her up for 18 years of responsibility. We're going to go through whatever we got to go through with. And I'm going to show reaction video this is my real reaction and honestly I was saying that I wasn't going to review the Krishan Rock and Blueface show because it really just gets on my nerves and I feel like I'm going to eat Yala Van Zandt y'all to death but I think there are some good pieces that we can get out of here one let's talk about the cons Zeus does not miss an opportunity to exploit this baby is going to grow up knowing and seeing and documenting all of these things and I can't even as I'm saying, I can't even blame that completely on Zeus. That's also the parents. He is on there multiple times saying, get rid of this pregnancy, get rid of the pregnancy. And then, you know, we obviously have Krishan um, feeling some type of way about it. We see, uh, you know, her doing 
you know a polygraph test which is going to be interesting we all know that blue face is very toxic very narcissistic like narcissistic behaviors and traits Krishan, i think that she is manipulative in her way as well but because she's a woman a beautiful woman might i add um and I don't want to say performative God fearing, but it's just mighty funny when she 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 know when to say them prayers. And I can't even say that. Let me take it back, y'all. But I'm just keeping it real. And I'm gonna start keeping it real with y'all because that's just how I feel. Sometimes I feel like these people be performing um, their their uh, spirituality. But I think that this is gonna be a good opportunity for us to kind of see even more what's happening, see even more of how much Blueface is trash and how Krishan is trash together. Um, and I think that they might be better off separate, which it seems like that's what they're going to be anyway. Um, I think Rock is not fully understanding her fame in the moment of her shooting. I feel like now she is. Now she is. We see her at the shows getting support for the other from the other women who are way more successful than a blue face and a black face than whatever. And Krishan has the potential to do that as well because she's so beloved by the public. Um, production seems like it's on production said hey this is gonna be a cash cow we just gotta we just gotta stay in and that first season y'all I'm telling you it was it was just ugly um, it really wasn't even that entertaining to be quite honest with you I see that the family is more involved which means it's gonna be more drama more eyes we see that the little scuffle between maybe the sister and the the Krishan. remember they were just doing the baddies um audition she was like why would you um she just tried to fight you bro i'm not doing that and it seemed like Krishan pushed her and he pushed her back whatever i don't know um interesting i want to see more of the uh, Krishan rocks family i think that if we can see more of her family we can have a better understanding carlisa please no carlisa no carlisa i don't want to see her i'm tired of her voice and the way that she talked with jonathan i just i just can't with carlisa um the mom i am interested in seeing the mom obviously there was some drug use there girl there i say so oh, let me not let me not let me not let me not give me count um i'm interested and i said i wasn't gonna do it y'all i said i wasn't gonna do it but i am interested and we're gonna have to see what it gives first couple episodes i don't want to see her begging i don't want i think i think this show is really going to probably do it's going to be very polarizing we're either going to really rally behind krishan which she's a pregnant woman the optics come on now come on now and i really feel like Blueface, like yeah you get money and this is a quick money grab but what is it going to do after feel what i'm saying like people really don't understand the optics when they're in the spotlight um and i guess they don't really care because sometimes you know we, we've made it lucrative to just be rambunctious and terrible and all of these other things so we'll just have to see how those things play out um we're either going to really rally it behind krishan or we're going to really rally behind or maybe have a better understanding of movies and I, f I find that really hard to do because he was just on instagram live and jada jay nasty she looked the fucking mask girl what was what was nasty about what she was giving she looked out of whack out of sync off rhythm um unseasoned not interested but <clears throat> i saw the kid in the pantry which the pantry was empty by the way girl he and he's talking about some it's booty cheeks in here son why would your your i don't even know how old his son is a baby a baby sexualizing this baby like that i don't care what y'all say y'all can be like oh but they put that's not right it, whether it's your homosexuality heterosexuality he is a child allow children to be children that's the end of the discussion y'all can say what y'all want it's going to get blocked because that's just how it is and what it is he's a child he's a baby he's not even hitting puberty yet make it make sense um Krishan, I listen, ba listen, let me let me go because this is I'm getting pissed off because I couldn't believe he said that. And I can't believe there wasn't enough outrage. I mean, I clearly wanted to make a video on it. And I think I'm gonna just continue to make videos as I can. Not even as I can, but um I'm still gonna make videos, but I might not be on camera as much. I feel like if I'm not on camera, if I don't have the pressure of being on camera as much, then I can create more content, which I feel like is what I should do. Drop down in the comments if y'all ever want. Let me know what y'all think. Um, because I think I will be able to create more. Anyway, y'all, let me know what y'all think. As always, I'm sending you much love and much light, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.